A battle is brewing in Washington over the best way to combat high gas prices. Democrats want to strip the five biggest oil companies of $2 billion a year in tax breaks, but Republicans say that's not the answer. Of course we have to do something about the exorbitant gas prices, and the best way to start with that is to do something about the five big oil companies getting subsidies they don't need. The push, which had the backing of Senator Harry Reid, comes at a time when drivers in Las Vegas are paying nearly $4 a gallon for gas. The bill would have repealed oil industry tax breaks over a decade, saving about $2 billion. Today's vote was an effort to put Republicans on the hot seat over their support for the oil industry at a time when it's making record profit. The Democratic measure meant to respond to huge industry profits and $4 a gallon gas prices. To end huge tax incentives given to the nation's five largest oil companies. Reid launched the legislation saying oil companies are making tens of billions in profits. Today, Senator Harry Reid says he supports increasing domestic oil production in hopes of driving down fuel costs, but he is being cautious, saying more domestic drilling will not completely solve our problem. We can't lose sight of the fact that our great country uses more than 25% of the oil on any given day. And we have less than 3% of the oil reserves in the world.